includes nature, culture, adventure, and a stable full of style. This isn't just a trip, it's Golf Advisor's round trip, the Palm Beaches. With 39 vibrant, diverse, welcoming communities, 47 miles of pristine coastline, 29 beach parks, and beautiful weather all year long, it's easy to see why Florida's golf capital should be at the top of every destination list. I'm heading to the coast to start my discovery of the Palm Beaches at the Palm Beach Par 3. Carolyn, what is it like growing up in the Palm Beaches? Do you remember that TV show Flipper where you're like swimming in the, you know, in the ocean with the dolphins and it was very undeveloped, lots of natural beauty. It was like you could play golf in the morning, we'd do some tennis or go on the boat. Fishing is huge here. We're so close to the Gulf Stream in the Bahamas. It's an amazing place to grow up. For you as an adult, what, what is it that's so special to you? Weather, one, and two, yeah. community. I mean, it's a real sense of community. Yeah. Palm Beach is the place to be, no question. What you're keeping in mind here is the Atlantic Ocean is just over that green, so the wind is blowing, even though you might not feel like it. Yeah. So we're going uphill, so our distance here is 90, pins back left, so yeah, club and a half. Okay. All right? Yeah, I think I, this is about my 105, 110 club. Perfect. So. Perfect. Should be okay. When it's breezy, swing easy. Okay. <laughs> looking good. Get up. Come on. Hey. Ah, I think hey I'm going to be your official caddy. That's all I'm right, saying. Thank you. Hopefully I'm not just made to be the caddy today. No, no, no. Okay. I feel greatness from you. Okay. Come left a little. Turn. All right. You're on there. So good job. All right. We're both dancing. The music is not necessarily very loud, but we're on the dance. That's right. That's right. How many times would you say you have played this course? I would put it in the hundreds. This is just an absolute gem, and it's super affordable. So it doesn't feel like municipal golf. No. It's a private club experience. From the way you're treated in the pro shop to the amazing food we have upstairs at Alfresco to how our staff is. I mean, look at the quality of this course. We don't want golf to be intimidating. Yeah. We want to grow the game, and we want people to come and have a great time, and whether they had their best round of their life or wasn't their best day. Or if they get beat up out here, at least it's exactly. beautiful. It's beautiful. It's going to break to the left, so we want to play it out to the right about a foot. These are very they're, friendly they're greens. Green. They're friendly yeah. greens. It's good looking. Get in there. Come on. Ah, ah. What a good line, though. It's a very welcoming environment. We want people to feel like this is a great place to learn the game, to grow the game, to get better. Bring your children. I mean, at the, our driving range, you'll always see everyone with their children in tow and we love that and we want that and we want it to be this very welcoming family-friendly environment we're the number three ranked golf digest par three in the country top 50 most fun golf courses to play and that includes not just par threes you know every golf course in the united states so this is a golf destination there's a type of golf course for everybody in the palm beaches and there's enough of them because it's like the golf capital of the world that you can get out and get a tea time and then in the afternoon go snorkeling or scuba diving or paddle boarding or fishing or cycle or do any of the recreational activities that we have here in the Palm Beaches. Beautiful roll. Well Thank done. You. Thanks Thank so, so much. much. Thank you. Appreciate it. Come back and see us. I will be back. All this golf and ocean air have made me hungry. Lucky for me, there's a first-class restaurant right in the clubhouse. All right, Chef. Yes. What are we making here today? So today, we're, we're going to make a version of, of meatballs, but here we actually call them golf balls. So what we're going <laughs> to make, what we have here is brown pork shoulder. We have some sliced prosciutto and some mortadella. Mortadella. Normal meatballs, you would add fillers and bread crumbs and things like that, but this isn't the way that we do this. So, okay. so what I need you to do, I need you to mix prosciutto. All of it? All of it. Okay. Half of that guy, Pecorino Romano, king of cheese. Delicious. Throw all of this? Oh. All of this, yeah. All I want extra it. cheese. It's shallots, onions, and roasted garlic that I pre-cooked before. That Just smells really good. A pinch of rosemary. Boom, bam. Yeah. Bam. <laughs> A little thyme. 
The key to this one is fresh oregano. So, mix her up. Okay, just get, just get in there. In there. There's, there's no wrong way to tackle it. Chef, how long have you been down here in Palm Beach? I fell in love with Palm Beach when I was very young. And it's paradise. Pretty much we live in paradise. You play a lot of golf? I wouldn't say play, <laughs> but I try to hit the golf ball every now and again. It's okay. really good. So then the next step is to get this baking for a little while, get a little color on it. Okay. So now we braise this for a good period, like five or six hours until they break down. But so happens I have some so, here. Five to six hours <laughs> later. Five to six hours later. <laughs> now, since they're golf balls, I like to do a little play on it. So now this is a spicy <laughs> mix, green. This is the fairway. So now we made a little bechamel sauce. Anything cheese-based is like a religion for me, so this is great. Right. There are your meatballs. All right, do we have a fork? I need to eat this immediately. Yes, of course. All right, let's do it. All right. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Meatball. I mean, I don't mean to brag about it. <laughs> you can brag. Thank you, Chef. My pleasure. Well, I had a great pleasure. Thank you. Loved it. Filled it. Coming up on Golf Advisor Round Trip, the Palm Beaches. That's on it. Uh, yeah, it is. Don't forget the backswing. The backswing. Yeah, you know, they tell me that in golf, too. Oh! <laughs>